The Clarify Deep Learning ecosystem provides a complete platform for you to build your own custom AI-powered business solutions. To get started, visit Clarify.com. It's free to start, and we provide a wide variety of educational resources and support for your AI projects. Be sure to visit our model gallery and take a look at the large selection of pre-built, pre-optimized, highly performant models that are ready for you to use right out of the box. Clarify specializes in artificial intelligence for unstructured data. Uh, in this case, we're talking about image, video, text, and audio data that is not labeled or organized in such a way that it can be useful to your company. So let's take a look at how Clarify can help transform this unstructured data into something that's useful for you. Uh, to begin with, we would create an application. And when creating an application, uh, we get to choose a base workflow. Now, this base workflow is going to pre-process your data and really takes care of a lot of the complexity and a lot of the heavy lifting that will go into interpreting, searching, organizing, and otherwise making, making your uh, data more useful to you. In this example, we're going to use our general detection workflow, which is a bit of a Swiss army knife of a workflow that can help you not only locate ob objects in an image or video, uh, but it can help you understand what these objects are. Once you've created your application, um, just navigate over to add inputs or to data mode, as we like to call it, and simply upload uh, whatever images and videos you'd like to work with. It's as simple as that. You can see here in a moment, once I've uploaded some sample images, we get a little check mark, uh, mark that indicates that the images have been successfully indexed. Clarify takes care of all of the complexity and infrastructure required to support artificial intelligence models being used in production. And let's take a look at what this means. So here we see just a variety of a kind of a random selection of images. And here we are looking at a picture of some hot dogs. And we've got a number of options on our, uh, in the right-hand side, in the right-hand panel. And let's just take a look at the Detections tab to see what objects are now identified by our model. You can see we get a box uh, outlining each hot dog in the image. And um, down below, we get a more specific view of the app workflow. And we see not only these outlined images of each hot dog, but we see the predicted concept, which in this case are hot dogs. In this next image, uh, we're looking at a traffic scene and our versatile uh, general detection model functions just as well here, identifying relevant objects, cars and people, and then predicting concepts that are appropriate for each um, uh, region that are detected by the detection model. So here we see cars predicted and um, other relevant terms are offered. Now these these predicted words then can be used to label your data, um, automate processes, and otherwise enrich um, a resource which might otherwise be difficult to work with. But what happens when you want to go beyond the capabilities of one of our models that have been uh, prepared for you and are ready to use right out of the box. What if you need a model that can identify your own custom concepts that your business cares about? Well, this is extremely common and Clarify has made it incredibly easy for you to customize models um, for your own liking. Uh, and what we would uh, use here is you're going to create a context-based classifier which is going to enable you to modify this general detection model, um, in this case, to represent, uh, recognize different models of Tesla. Uh, you can see here we're just clicking train, and this new model is trained and ready to go in, in just a matter of seconds um, on a uh, relatively small data set, just 88 inches that we put in here. Uh, we can click evaluate to get a rough and ready rock ox score. So how this gives us an idea of how performant our model is, how good our model is. And then we can check it out for ourselves. Now I've got another image here um, that was not annotated and not part of our uh, training data set. And we can see that it's not annotated and yet um, our model is already predicting with high confidence uh, the correct model of Tesla. 
Some of the largest and best known companies in the world are search engines, and artificial intelligence plays an important role in all types of search. Clarify gives you the ability to use visual search um, for your applications, and uh, this is incredibly powerful across a wide variety of use cases. But to give you an example of how this works, we're just going to uh, look, use our face recognition model um, and train it to recognize people by name. So here we're just adding some people's names into our application um, as concepts. And we can just click this little search icon and without any extra work, the model is able to quickly sort and filter our data set to find uh, other images of uh, a given person just based on visual similarity. Um, and by checking these boxes, we can now label um, these images that came up in our search uh, with the individual's name. And we can use this labeled data now to train a model to recognize the person by name. And this can be used for a wide variety of authentication and identification tasks um, related to recognizing people by face. Uh, the exact same search technology is very versatile though. So you'd be able to use this for recognizing products. Uh, you'd be able to search for uh, a mug that looks similar to other mugs or a chair that looks other similar to other chairs. Um, it could also be used to search for similar scenes, a beach scene, um, um, a street scene. Uh, really it's anything that is visually distinct. So as long as it can be uh, an object that can be discerned based on visual differences, you can, um, the sky's the limit, anything your imagination can come up with, you can create it as a concept and train your model to recognize it by name. And Clarify just makes it dead simple to get this done. And here you see we're uh, using the search functionality to sort and filter our data. Now there will be times when we want to label very large data sets. And this is where Scribe Labeler comes into play. We provide a specialized user interface that's dedicated just to data labeling and provide a number of useful tools that you can use uh, to delegate labeling tasks to a large team. Another powerful tool that is at your disposal when you're working in the Clarify platform is Mesh. Mesh does not require any programming expertise to use. Uh, you can use it right in the portal user interface um, and using a purely visual editor, um, but it is also available just like all the other functionality on Clarify. Uh, Mesh workflows are also available programmatically uh, through our API. Uh, but what we're going to take a look at here is uh, a simple auto annotation workflow uh, that we're able to build using Mesh that's going to automatically label our data once it's uploaded. Mesh helps you connect multiple models together and enables you to use the predictions from one model to power behavior in your business logic. So in this case, we're going to use the predictions from one model to determine whether or not we're going to add a label otherwise known as an annotation, uh, to a given input in our data set. And so what we've done here is we've created this new workflow, we've connected these models together, and we're now going to use this workflow to, to process a new input. So let's take a look at adding a video to our data set, and we're just going to browse and upload this video file. And once we choose our file here, um, it'll just take a moment to index this file. Videos uh, include a lot of individual frames of um, individual images, so they take a moment to upload, but you can see there it's been uploaded and indexed with the happy check mark. Let's click on this video, and let's go over again to our right-hand sidebar and make sure that we're using this new workflow that we've created to process our data. and. Um, now we can see that you know the, the, here are the various nodes in the workflow and the outputs from the various nodes and as we uh, click down uh, to this uh, good anno writer we can this is where the annotations were actually written um, and we get these blue boxes uh, where we've added um, annotations we've added bounding boxes to uh, all of the images in this video and so we're able to identify uh, the cars in the video this way. And you, you can see we can uh, hit play on the video and, and annotations are, are written to all of these images.
And that's just the beginning of what you can do with the Clarify platform. Find out more at Clarify.com.